Okay, here we go. <laughs> oh my Excuse god. Excuse me. Have you perchance seen any evil spirits? Oh, <gasps> you know what? I feel like this is perfect that I'm playing uh, Hu Tao right now. Uh, evil spirits? Oh, he's so apologies. cute. You're not from around here, are you? This question must sound a little confusing to you. He's adorable. I'm Chong Yun, a local exorcist from Liu. Those versed in the arts of exorcism refer to all forms of demons and monsters as evil spirits. Evil spirits have existed since ancient times. They lurk among the shadows in the lands of Liyue, stirring up all sorts of trouble and mischief. Oh my gosh. It is my duty to exorcise or destroy them and protect the citizens here from their evil doings. This is an ad... I get it. That's what the... Ooh. What if I say this? Is he going to get mad at me? How did you come to know of the vigilant Yaksha? Oh, look I at his smile! Great respect for the Yakshas. For generations, Yakshas and exorcists have been protecting Liyue together. One in plain sight, and the other in secret. Sorry, I digress. Judging from your response, it seems you aren't well versed in the realm of evil spirits. Okay, he liked that. But that's understandable. If I may ask, have you happened to come across anything strange recently? Sometimes even the most trivial matters prove helpful in my hunt for evil spirits. No, hmm, nothing in particular. Oh, I see. Well, fair enough. In that case, I guess I'll just have to try my luck with the clues I already have. What clues do you have now? <sighs> Only some scattered reports. I really. love his eyes. Nothing too significant yet. But if you're interested, I can tell you about some of the more useful ones I've gathered so far. I read a flyer that said, The test of courage is now being held on Wu Wang Hill. Bring your best friend and test your courage together. Then, recently, the sounds of footsteps and shouting have been heard outside people's windows at night. The noises have frightened the children and they are unable to sleep. And I could fall asleep to his voice. In Guili Plains. It flies and swirls, summons down fireballs, and makes all sorts of strange noises. Cases such as these might actually be worth our attention. Look at his- this is such a cute face that he does. Oh my god, why is he so pretty? Okay, um, the shadow in Ghoulie Plain sounds like it may be. A ruin hunter test of courage, doesn't that sound like an advertisement? Sometimes drunkards pass by people's windows at night, that's nothing unusual. Um, test of courage. I think something strange must have happened at the test of courage. I guess this so-called test is supposed to be like a test of metal. Its purpose must be to try the will and power of exorcists. <sighs> Do you think I'm not deciphering these clues correctly? They all sound pretty far-fetched. Perhaps I should just tell them that. <laughs> although, they all, although they seem far-fetched, I better not tell him that. He seems like quite the persistent character. So you don't think any of these clues are related <gasps> to evil spirits? Look at his face! Stop. Stop. Please give me a moment to calm myself. <laughs> What's wrong with him? <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't realize it would be so devastating to you. No, it's fine. I've been this way since I was young. Oh, is it health related? Are you okay? No, not at all. I guess you could say that I just tend to be... unstable. You know, emotionally. It causes me to become very uncomfortable at times. <laughs> this tendency of getting stirred up easily is what people call a pure yang spirit. Oh my god. Um... I read about this in his lore that... Well, I thought it was only spicy food that triggers him, though. I, or is it just any, like, I'm confused. I thought it was just spices. Stirred up easily? I couldn't tell that from your appearance. Yes, well, such a constitution is very rare. But it's a potent weapon for an exorcist. My constitution alone is capable of scaring off evil spirits. But I must constantly focus on my emotions. Otherwise, I may easily do something out of control. <laughs> anyway, I carefully selected these clues from an ocean of information. I can't believe they're all completely irrelevant. I'm scared. Oh no. I'm still feeling quite uncomfortable. There's heat growing in my chest. I... I... I can't breathe. <laughs> uh, uh, how about some water? No. I'll, I'll be alright. I, I brought some popsicles with me for just such situations. <laughs> He's so weird. <laughs> I feel much better now. I don't know. That's so funny. He's got to eat it. He's got to eat a popsicle to calm down. I. <laughs> okay. 
You know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of like a baby that needs a pacifier. Like, hold on, I need my pacifier. Like, I'm getting. That's what it reminds me of. So, canonically, Chong Yoon is baby. It looked tasty. Actually, they're quite tasteless. Otherwise, I wouldn't be able to stomach them. What? They just taste like ice? <sighs> Thank you for your concern. I'm fine now. But what should I do next if all these clues are irrelevant? Canonically, Chang Yoon is baby because he has to have his pacifier popsicle. Otherwise, he has a meltdown. So, he really is. He really is baby. Actually, it seems someone's been watching us this whole time. Yes, I've noticed him too. It's no coincidence that we both noticed it. He's a little I'm sure boy. He's watching us. <laughs> but it doesn't seem he has any intentions other than looking at us. Perhaps there's something he wishes to tell us. Let's go ask. Let's go and ask him. Right. He might need our help. Uh huh. Oh, asthma. Oh. Sorry, I'll leave now. No, please, relax. There's no need to worry. Look at his face. We're not here for trouble. We couldn't help but notice you standing here for a while and thought that you might have something on your mind. No, there's nothing on my mind. I just thought the thing you were eating looked tasty. DeLong, it's just my ice. My sister just loves food. She's always super happy whenever we get some tasty It's literally snacks. an icicle. No. I'm her big brother, <laughs> and I should take care of her, but... Mom says we're too poor and she never lets me buy any snacks. Oh my oh, god. You mean one of my popsicles? I'm afraid you wouldn't find them very tasty though. Oh, it doesn't matter. My sister's never had anything like that before. I know she'd be happy to try one. It's just ice. Mm. Come to think of it, I've never had one either. I see. You never had ice? Hmm. Yeah, that I finished all of be Benny's difficult. hangouts. I know so many sad kids. What's wrong? Well, I only kids have two are not allowed left. to be happy in Genshin Impact. To me, and I might need them if we encounter an evil spirit. Without them, I might not be able to control my constitution. Uh, what if you just give him one of the popsicles? Since he's has a sister, you should probably give him both. <gasps> both. Oh, you're right. I'll just have to make do without my Are we about to witness? Now. Here, my young friend. Are we about to witness a chaotic Chong Yoon? You and your sister can each have one. Really? I'm a bad influence. Wow. Thanks a lot. <laughs> just wait till my sister tries this. I haven't seen her smile in a long time. Oh. Whoa. That's already starting to melt. Excuse me. <laughs> I better hurry back to Chihu Rock now. I never expected that something I used to suppress my yang energy would be so appealing to kids. I mean, it's food. Uh, but I wonder how I'll manage without any popsicles. That's literally kids. What are you eating? You have to tell a kid everything is spicy, so they leave you alone. Oh no, you can't have this water, it's spicy. No, 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 you cannot have this candy. This is spicy candy. Um, are they difficult to make? I usually get my popsicles from one min restaurant on special order. Special the order? The are not complicated, but the restaurant is always bustling with business, and Chef Mao is usually too busy to take my order. Now that I've used all my supply, I'll have to trouble him to make more. I'll go with you. Oh, no need. I'm sure I can manage it on my own. Mmm, I was the one who convinced you to give away all your popsicles in the first place. I'm a little worried about you. I'm concerned about your abundance of yang. Um... I was the one who convinced you to give away all your popsicles in the first no, place. No, please don't feel at fault. I think you made the right choice. Did I? But if you're offering to come along, then I won't refuse. <sighs> all right. Please follow me to One Min Restaurant. Oh, this is bad. Chef Mao is not at the restaurant right now. And oh, great. Selling. We'll have to wait until he returns. What do we do about the evil spirits? If it's not too difficult, I can try to make some. Oh, are you a good cook? Sure. Um, making popsicles seems easy enough. Look at his- I just love this expression. Why is he so cute? I like mustard, too. I like, um, like spicy mustard. Then I'll leave it to you. Thanks for your help. Do you know what ingredients we should use? Uh, I'm afraid all I know is that it requires water. But to imbue the effect that suppresses my yang energy, Perhaps something special is required. Like different plants, fruits, or herbs, for example. 
Do you have any experience with such things? No. <laughs> Let's try chewy and chili and slime condensate. I already know. I'm doing it. Uh, that sounds a little dangerous. But as the saying goes, stop. I fire with fire. He's letting me. I trust your judgment. No, he's letting me do it. <laughs> Why would he let me do it? <laughs> Have you procured all the ingredients for the popsicle? Why is he letting me do this? He trusts me that much. I'm crying. I am going- I- Oh my god, I cannot believe- Is it finished? I'm- Ooh, The color seems to be off. Let me try one. No! <laughs> okay. Here it goes. It's so spicy. <laughs> My throat is on fire. <laughs> oh, no, no. This is not good. Oh, he died! His brave bravery and trustworthiness are truly remarkable, but despite that, <laughs> he died. Look at everyone in the street. <laughs> Damn it. I was hoping he would like he would do something wild. <laughs> we killed him. I, why is it literally my first my first routes with these characters? I have literally killed somebody. Every single one. What's wrong with me? Oh, this is bad. Okay, so what now happens now? We'll have to wait until he returns. What do we do about the evil spirits? I can try and make some. Oh, are you a good cook? I often cook for myself when adventuring in the wilderness. Then I'll leave it to you. Thanks for your. Uh, I'm a okay. different plan. Do you have any experience? I cannot believe I did Julian and Chili and Slime Condensate. I'm dying. Uh, let's try Miss Flower and Chinsing. Let's try Sensetias and Valberries. Hmm. Those do sound refreshing. Uh, He's gonna trust me again. I hate point. this. I feel so bad. I'm absolutely the worst. I'm the worst friend. Do I not have any sun? Oh, they're there. Okay. Listen, let me tell you how it is. Oh, these look even tastier than my original popsicles. Ooh. Let me try one. Mm, yes. It tastes fruity and sweet. Oh, it's baby. Delicious. He happy. But I'm afraid it's not as effective at suppressing my yang energy as Chef Mao's popsicles. I thought it just any popsicles would do. Sadly not. But in any case, these should be good enough for now. These popsicles really are delicious. I bet that kid we met earlier would be thrilled to taste this flavor. Uh, it'd have to be a lot more. I'm sure the kid would eat most of them and still be hungry. <laughs> <laughs> right. But he mentioned his family is not well off. I'd still like to help them if I can. But what about your search for evil spirits? Exorcism is my means of helping the people of Liyue live more peaceful and happy lives. If that kid really needs my help, then helping him would be just different means to the same end. Oh my goodness, he's so sweet. I'll go with All you. Right. I remember the kid mentioned that he was headed for Chihu Rock. Let's go find him. Oh. Um. You didn't steal them, did you? <gasps> no, I didn't steal them. I talked to a nice person and they just gave them to me. So you've been asking for food on the street? I've already told you such behavior makes you look uneducated. What? How could you ask a stranger for food? Is that any different from being a beggar? Wow. But I didn't ask them for it. They asked me if I wanted some. That's it. No more lies. Just be honest about your mistake. Uh, excuse me. He got those popsicles from me. He never asked us. We just gave them to him. Uh, yeah, this is the nice person I was telling you about. What? what who are you? My name is Chong Yun. Mm. As you could probably tell from my attire, I'm an exorcist. Your son really seemed interested in popsicles, so we thought we'd make a batch for you. That's why we're paying you a visit. Oh my goodness. There's no need to worry. Uh, oh, I see. Sorry, I seem to have misunderstood him. Yeah, you did. What I the hell? Delay. It was wrong for mommy to blame you. It's I okay, hate her. So am I allowed Call to CPS, to please. Popsicle man, now? Sure. Popsicle man? Please keep an eye on your sister. Mommy will be back after some errands, okay? 
Don't worry, I'll look after her. Bye, mommy. Oh my god. Thanks. If it wasn't for you, I would have been in big trouble again. Thank you for the popsicle. It was so cool and delicious. <laughs> Actually, we've made some more. Oh, wow. Look at all the popsicles. Thanks. Don't eat them all in one go. You'll get you'll get a brain freeze. Okay, I got it. <gasps> You're like heroes. You're like your heroes. Yeah, I've been telling a story to my sister recently, as she admires the story's heroes very much. They're chivalrous, just, and they help the weak fight against evil. Oh my god. And the heroes always have a good partner. One hero can beat up two bad guys, but with a good partner, they can defeat even more. You two must be very good partners. Uh, well... That's right, we're great partners. Hey, I knew it! You two must get along well together. Um, we're gonna go play right now. Oh, would you come and play with us? Yeah. Don't be so childish. What? I'm sure heroes like them have important things to do. Huh? You mean you can't play? Um, it wouldn't hurt to go play a little, right? Huh? Oh, well, I... Uh, sorry, could I have a word with you, Traveler? Wow, what? Are we not allowed to play? They look so excited to play with us, but I'm sure they'll be disappointed if we refuse. Let's go play with them for a while. Uh, sure, that's fine, but... Something on your mind? No, it's nothing. I'm just a little bit worried. For what? I spend most of my time purging evil spirits and practicing thaumaturgy. And besides my training, I also need to constantly focus deeply on my own emotions to avoid losing control. He can't even play! So, what I mean is that I seldom have time for anything that others would consider fun. I don't even know the first thing about playing with kids. <laughs> he doesn't know how to play! I think we're heroes, so they must be very excited to play with us. But I'm afraid they'll just find me boring. Um, just treat it as if you're getting together with friends. Does he have friends? I see. But my friends aren't the type who'd go out and play. Alright, let's give it a try. But I'll need your help if I don't know what to do. Hey, they're back! So can we go play now? Shin Cho uh, would definitely yeah. play. I'll try. <laughs> Yay! Boring! No need to be nervous. We're gonna have a blast. I can't believe he's nervous about oh. playing with kids. Um, you'll be the ghost, but, um, don't peek until you count to 50. 50? Who? Me? <laughs> um, he might not be familiar with the rules. Huh? I don't know anyone who doesn't know how to play hide and seek. Uh, okay, you can be the ghost then. <laughs> He'll never be able to find me. Oh my god. You mean, we just hide anywhere we want? Of course, silly. That's the most fun part of the game. But don't follow me. There's only room for one person in my seat. You're nervous to play with kids, really? Uh, all right. But I still don't really know what to do. Uh, who knows? Maybe you'll be good at this. You're right. I'll give it a try. He's so freaking Yay! cute. Let's go hide. No peeking now. I can't believe they, they're making us count to 50. Usually it's like 10 or 20. Okay, look for three hidden people. Can I use my sight? Is that cheating? <laughs> oh my gosh, there's so many places for them to hide! Oh, just kidding. Hello! Huh? You found me! How did you know to look for hey, me? Hey, Irina! Here? Welcome in! Oh, auto. Hey! You didn't peek, did you? Uh, no. I'm just very good at this. <laughs> okay, who is next? Go. Oh, there. Come. Come and see these rare and precious curios. Oh, I'm out. Dang, where are they? Hello? Would someone be on the roof? 
Actually, this is a good idea. Over there. This is a good idea to get on top of a roof so I can get like a better vantage point. Hey, Amaya, welcome in. <clears throat> As we wait 20 minutes. Oh my god. I was very good for for the first one. <laughs> Apparently not for the rest. Over there, points with lips. Yep. Just Filipino things. Um... Would somebody climb on top of the rock? No. Dang, okay, what the heck? Hello? I'm good at this. <laughs> oh, you found me. I can't believe I lost. I didn't expect you to be so good at this. Haha, -ha, see? All right. Are we looking for Chang Yoon? Try something new at the Wan Min restaurant. Phew. Huh? Dang, where is he? Huh. So then maybe Chang Yoon is actually good at this game because yeah, like where where is he? Oh, he's right here! Wait, is he just standing here? He's not even trying- he's just out in the open. I never expected you to find me so easily. Why would you hide here? I thought that this would be the perfect spot. I've been close so many fact, times. I'm well versed in the methods of locating evil spirits. And I have lots of experience. <laughs> Yet I couldn't find it! <laughs> this spot is dusty and a bit blue, Listen! Which gives off an unsettling energy. I was looking at the evil actual hiding places, okay? Places. He was just literally just standing here. I didn't think he was going to be here. <laughs> You're trying to use Thaumaturgy to play hide and seek. Yeah, I guess my experience as an exorcist doesn't apply very well. <laughs> Since I've been found, I guess I must admit my defeat. Oh my god. It's a simple game, yet quite intriguing once you begin to play. Maybe we could play it together again sometime. Sure, we could invite more friends to join us. Let's do it. Let's go. Oh, can we imagine Chong Yoon and um Shincho? Who else? Hu Tao. Oh, Tempest, thank you so much for gifting a sub. That's so sweet. Uh, Mar Marlia, congrats on getting that sub. You enjoy your emotes for a month. And Tempest it says it's your first gift sub in the channel. Thank you so much. That's very sweet. I do appreciate it so, so much. Thank you. Thank you. Invite the Liyue squad. squad. Yeah, Shangling and, um, ooh, can you, can we imagine Zhongli playing hide and seek? Do you two know how to cook at all? Wow. Don't be so selfish. This is the worst we mom. With us for a long time already. Well, if we played for so long, then a little longer won't hurt. Wow, <laughs> Cloud, what's wrong with you? But Leave I'm him alone. The taste of food, as long as it doesn't make me feel unwell. Unwell? Are you sick? Mommy says you should always take care of What the fuck? No, it's not so serious. I just need to be careful about what Are we just going to like ignore the fact that this mom is the worst? Noodles with mountain delicacies. The dish tastes great, but I can't eat anything warm. So I came up with my own variation called cold noodles with mountain delicacies. Oh. Cold noodles? That sounds nice and cool. I want to try. Well, I don't think they taste quite as good as when they're served warm. No way. I'm sure it's just as good as the popsicles. Oh my goodness. Uh, well... I know Chong Yoon is probably a little young, but I feel like he would be a better caregiver to these kids than their mom. Because this mom is the worst. 
Um, I happen to have some ingredients here. Hmm. All right. We can use the kitchen. Look, he's here. cooking them dinner and everything. I'll the noodles once all the ingredients are ready. Um, you should open a restaurant. You, you flatter me. Oh my goodness. No need to. She's probably though. stressed. Still, no way to treat your children. Ah, uh, you, you flatter me. No need to exaggerate, though. Let's serve the dish to the kids. I hope they'll like it. Wow, it tastes amazing. Oh. I've never had anything like this before. Mm. You're not only a hero, but but also a chef. Oh my god. What a surprise. Is there more? I want seconds. Me too, me too. Whoa, slow down there. There's plenty more. <laughs> oh, I'm so full. You're so amazing. Now that we're done, let's play more games. Oh my god. We are literally babysitting these children. Okay. Um, seems you're becoming quite popular. Yes. This is completely unexpected for me. I was sure that everyone would just think I'm boring. No way. You're so much fun. And if you weren't so icy all the time, you'd be even more Wow. Fun. Come on, let's go. I want to play something else. Oh my god. Oh my goodness. <gasps> this is my favorite. Look how adorable. Are you kidding me? You must truly be a knowledgeable and seasoned adventurer. Do I look like Chong Yoon? I have to make my eyes bigger. <laughs> I was just using good old common sense. I still have numerous clues from my friend, which I haven't sold. Hey, Kaylan. With my limited experience, it's hard to tell whether they're reliable leads. If you'd be willing, could you please come and take a look with me? Sure thing. All right. Let's go to Wanwen Bookhouse. Please, follow me. I really think that Chong Yoon's hangouts so far are my favorite. This is a note that I received from a friend. It has many clues about evil spirits on it. He keeps talking about his friends. Here, Bookhouse, just say, just say note, you are uh, dating Shincho and get it over with. Help, I'll just read the clues to you, and you can help me judge if they're credible or not based Actually, on your experience. Actually, oh, no, he can't date Shincho because if he gets too excited, then like it ruins everything. So maybe, maybe they're not. Like maybe he he literally can't. All right. Here are the <clears> four <throat> clues. At the foot of Mount Chingsa is a violet grass that has turned into a gigantic, man-eating monster. Also, there's a ghostly shadow skulking about Feiyun's slope at night. It's suspected to be a vengeful spirit. And finally, lurking in Li Yue Harbor is a massive demon that was transformed from a popsicle. A popsicle? Huh. I've never encountered any such things before. Anyway. Could you pick the one that seems most plausible and likely to be the work of evil spirits? Uh... Lurking in Liyue Harbor is a massive demon that was transformed from a popsicle. I don't know. That doesn't seem like it's right. Um, at the foot of, of Mount uh, Chingse is a violet grass that has turned into a gigantic man-eating monster. I don't think that's it either. Uh, there's a ghostly shadow skulking about Feiyun's slope at night. It's suspected to be a vengeful spirit. This one, obviously. Mm, this is possible, <clears throat> but it sounds too similar to previous rumors. Many people often pass through Feiyun's slope, so perhaps it's just some sort of misunderstanding. Hmm. How about these clues? Deep in the Sea of Clouds, a marauding demon has been raiding commercial fishing boats and building a luxurious palace. Or, in Zhuiyun Karst, there's a piece of a thousand-year-old amber that has gained consciousness and now roams about causing trouble. What in the world? And lastly, it's said that people often see a demon who loves eating chilies in Wanmin restaurant. Probably a demon? Um, I'm saying this one. Uh, even I can tell this is talking about Xiangling's little guoba. Fuck! <laughs> demon. Okay. Here are a few more clues. A strange man wearing a mask and wielding a pole was once seen in the distance around- I'm not good at this! There's something eerie about his presence. Or, someone saw an exorcist with blue hair who was actually a transformed demon. 
Wait, what? <laughs> and finally, there is a vigilant demon adept at concealing itself in mist. Recently, people have found traces of it in Mingyun Village, Guili Plains, it's hard. and Yao Guangzhou. Hey, Dino. Uh, what if I say, what if I say this one? Is he going to get mad at me? A strange man wearing a mask and wielding a pole was once in the... Wearing a mask. What? Isn't this Zhao? There is a vigilant demon adept at concealing itself in the mist. Recently, people have found traces of it in Mingyong Village. Guli. I'm going to say this one because <laughs> I really want to see what he says, but... Now that you mention it, I may have heard of this one. I've been trying to track it, but the spirit's so cautious that I don't think we'll ever have a chance of catching it unless it decides to show itself. It appears most of these clues are either not reliable or nearly impossible to investigate. It seems like there is little here no. that we can actually use. Yeah, who gave? Oh, many of these are from my friend, Sincho. I knew it! He's well-read and very knowledgeable. Not to mention he's always willing to extend a helping hand. He always provides me with lots of reliable information. If it weren't for my pure yang spirit, I would have already vanquished numerous demons because of him. Oh my god. I'm sure of it. I should find a chance to thank him personally. Oh my god. I can't believe this is happening. Um, such an enviable friendship. Yes, he always goes out <gasps> oh of his god. way for me, but he never seems to mind and helps me all the same. Also, he often has something interesting to say. I'm quite glad that I get along with him. What the heck? Sorry, I digress. Oh my god. I've found another snippet of information here. Okay, he's in love. There aren't many details, but it clearly mentions Wu Wang Hill. If we include the test of courage rumor from before, there are already two clues pointing there. I've also noticed that Did a child just Wu push Wang me? Hill has been very abnormal recently. I hope we can find let's something there. Look. All right, let's head out and see what we can find. It, so, did did a child push me? It looked like a kid, <laughs> not the child. <laughs> This place seems quite ordinary. So ordinary that I don't even feel that it's worth investigating. Same feeling here. Wuwang Hill's unusual weather and peculiar surroundings are a source of constant rumors, most of which are untraceable and can never be proven. So, I no. suppose this could only be expected. It seems you seldom have anything to show for all your efforts. Is that also due to your pure yang spirit? I guess so. Like I mentioned before, my yang energy tends to just scare away evil spirits. You may think it's beneficial for me to have such a condition, and therefore there is no real need for me to practice thaumaturgy. But if I renounced my practice of thaumaturgy, and one day met an evil spirit that didn't fear my yang energy, then I may not be able to exercise it. If I merely spend my time training without actually putting it into practice, then how would I ever know the fruits of my labor or what skills I needed to improve? But to this very day, mm -hmm. despite the many exorcisms I have performed, I have yet to see a single demon. Not to mention one that I needed to defeat using thaumaturgy. Chong Yun, you're getting a little bit too, too Sorry, excited. Sorry, I shouldn't rant like that. Yes. I'm fine. I've gotten used to such feelings. No, don't give up. Since we're already here, let's go check the two locations mentioned in the clue. Where you could live next to, um, you could live next to Child's 50 siblings. I know this mist. It was left by some kind of evil spirit. It's very thick and never disperses. The evil spirit may have been here recently. So it seems the clue is real? Yes. It was not all in vain. But we mustn't act rashly. If this mist remains here, it can easily contaminate the area. Once it contaminates monsters such as Hillichurls, it could even make them more aggressive and dangerous to anyone nearby. Oh, great. Or if it happens to contaminate any adventurers passing by, the consequences would be unimaginable. Okay, uh, it's your time to shine, Exorcist. My pleasure. My Let's pleasure. Let's inspect the surrounding area. To Genshin see if Crossing, any more mess exactly. Like this. Once we've cleaned up this mess, we'll continue forth. Remember, there might be danger ahead. We should be prepared for a fight. Um, you're very calm. It's second nature to me. Exorcism is a solemn and serious matter. It's on me if you or anyone else gets hurt due to my negligence. There's no time to lose. Let's go. The path is <clears> here <throat> as well as the tracks. It'll be difficult to Oops. follow it any further. I didn't think your pure yang spirit could be so powerful. It must have sensed me as a threat from a long way off. That's why it ran with such haste. 
It seems that this is still not the kind of spirit that can overcome my abundant yang energy and fight me head on. But if we don't deal with it, it'll just go somewhere else and harm people, right? <sighs> don't worry. I'll continue tracking it for a few days. It won't dare show its face around here again. <laughs> but you still want to see it, right? It's a shame that we can't take good care of it for- oh, we- okay. Yes. Defeating it once and for all would certainly make all this worth our effort. Why is he so cute? Huh? Why do you seem so disappointed? Endgame is let Chong Yun use his thaumaturgy, exactly. I can't help but feel like this was a waste of our time. No, quite the contrary. Not only did we clean up the traces of the evil spirit, but we also took care of those monsters. We've done our jobs as exorcists. My only regret is that I didn't get to drive it away using my thaumaturgy. This baby. But I'm already prepared to spend my life chasing this goal. So I do not regret such disappointments. Hmm, I guess you're right. Yes. So please, cheer <gasps> oh up. Oh my god. Actually, I also wanted to thank you for not leaving me, even with my special condition, and for helping chase the evil spirit. Look at his to face here. Line. Even if we'd ended up running into an incredibly strong demon, I would have felt much safer with an experienced adventurer like you by my side. Your persistence made it hard for me to leave. I'm just doing my duty. Well, I appreciate it. Oh, it seems the weather is starting to clear up over there. Oh my gosh. Let's go have a look. Hmm. Perhaps there's nothing to worry about after all. Even though I didn't come face to face with that evil spirit, at least I met you. I'm not an evil spirit. Oh, no, uh, that came out wrong. <laughs> oh my god. What I'm trying to say is, we shouldn't focus only on the gains and losses of our journey. The things you see and the events you encounter along the way are equally important rewards. Oh my god. But what if the evil sp Oh my god! <laughs> this is so pretty. What if the evil spirits were the friends that we made along the way? Might actually be worth Doesn't that sound like an advertisement? I think something strange must have happened at the test of courage. I guess this so-called test is <sighs> Do you think I'm not- Wait, did I do it wrong again? Am I good? I say the top one? The bottom one. Because I said the top one before. I say the bottom one? Hmm. I think the clue about the test of courage is the most relevant. If strange things have been happening at the event. <sighs> but there's an unusual requirement for this event. You must be a team of two people in order to participate. That's quite normal. Is it? Huh. Perhaps you're right. If evil spirits do show up, then the two can take care of each other, I suppose. Anyway, if you have the time, would you join me for this event? You seem to have a good eye for discerning these clues. With your adventuring experience, I'm sure we'll track down those evil spirits in no time. Uh, sorry, I'm not, what if I say I'm not interested? Please, you must go with me. I don't know <laughs> if I'll be able to find anyone else. What about Shincho? My best friend is busy with other matters, and, and I worry that anyone else won't even be able to protect themselves. My best friend. You have my thanks. We should make haste. If there are evil spirits at the event, what's then he doing? Get dangerous. What's Shincho doing? Please be careful, everyone. Pay close attention to your surroundings and stay vigilant once you enter. And most importantly, don't get separated from your partner and wander off on your own. You'll most certainly be in for a scare if you go alone. Did you hear that? He's warning the event participants. Maybe something strange really did happen here. Let's investigate. I think you misunderstood that. <laughs> Welcome to the test of courage. You two must be very close friends. Wow. Actually, we just met. <laughs> no problem at all. Don't be shy. Just enjoy yourselves. But please drink this before you enter the test drink of courage. Drink what? This drink will boost the yang energy inside your body and lift your courage. Not only that, but this drink will also allow you to see things which are usually hidden from the naked eye. Pretty exciting, huh? Y yang energy? That's right. Ghosts are said to be full of yin energy. So more yang energy will surely deter them. Wait a minute. Oh, I've never heard of such a drink. Is it a secret recipe? Perhaps it's all just or psychological. Of, hmm, possibly. But why bother exaggerating it so much then? But if this drink really does boost Yang energy... I was gonna say, is this really a good idea? 
You see, I have a very rare constitution called a pure Yang spirit. Such a constitution allows me to scare away evil spirits, but it also makes me prone to emotional impulses. You seem like a very calm person to I'm me. I'm constantly focusing to keep my mind and body in a normal state, which usually works until I suffer from some external stress. Come now, what's with that serious expression on your face, lad? You aren't worried about the drink, are you? Oh my it's god. It's delicious and quite effective if I do say so myself. There's nothing to worry about. Or if you're still unsure, perhaps only one of you could take the drink. The person who takes the drink can protect the one who doesn't. It'll be exciting either way. Hmm. It's hard to refuse when you put it that way. Let's both drink it? This, honestly, like, I sound like... You know, when you, for, for those of us who are of age to drink, um, it sounds like that one friend that is really chaotic and it's like, don't worry, we'll be fine. Like you just have a couple drinks, you know, I'll have a couple, it'll be fine. And they end up just like, they're like the worst influence and they always, whenever you go drinking or whatever with them, they, they always just get you into nonsense and it's just a mess. That's the, that's what I sound like right now when I say let's both drink it. Here we go. All right, here it is. <laughs> Please drink it slowly. It sounds like we're drinking <laughs> it fast. Yes, that's it. You did great. You two <clears> can <throat> enter now. I'm starting to feel something after that drink. Oh, no. Uh, no, no, I'll be fine. Let's go investigate the area. Oh my god. <laughs> he is very uh, cute. So this is the test of courage. Oh, there are more people here than I imagined. They could all be in grave danger if there really is an evil spirit here. We must get to the bottom of this. I'm not too sure where we should start, but I know we'll find something once we start looking. These innocent participants are completely oblivious to the potential danger here. The test of courage we'll isn't actually them. dangerous, you know. What? Please, enlighten me. The participants are he just here to have fun. You mean, being scared is like entertainment to them? I see. <sighs> Maybe you're right. I'm certainly a stranger to entertainment Oh my god! All. I mostly spend my time purging evil spirits and practicing thaumaturgy. Besides training, I also need to constantly focus on my own emotions to avoid losing control. So I rarely have any time for leisure activities. He's so boring. I'm completely unfamiliar with what others <clears throat> consider entertainment. Hmm. Well, either way, let's check the area for any evil spirits just in case. Where should we start? Hmm. These are traces left by an evil spirit. No doubt about it. The traces are quite weak, though. So there are only two possibilities. Either the spirit that left the traces is very weak, or it has already left for some time now. Either way, these possibilities prove my hunch that there's indeed an evil spirit here. Are evil spirits the reason why Wu Wang Hill is so gloomy all the time? No, I don't think so. There have been many rumors regarding the cause of Wu Wang Hill's gloomy aura, but nothing is certain. Although, once it became the murky place you see now, it also began to attract more evil spirits. Anyway, these traces lead us one step closer to finding an evil spirit. Oh, it's an allergy? Don't is it? Over here again. What? Seriously, just leave me alone. Oh my god. W why must you be so obstinate? Just calm down. It's not what you think. No, don't even bother. You think I don't know what you're doing? What is happening? Stop. Not a step closer. <laughs> don't be afraid. I'll exercise it right now. Exercise? <laughs> Who are you? And what are you talking about? Wait, what? Everyone just calm down. Oh, he's just a person? <laughs> uh, it seems I've made a mistake. After seeing her resist so violently, I thought for sure an evil spirit was trying to harm her. No, nah, it's not like that at all. She's just throwing a tantrum. What? Excuse me? A tantrum? <gasps> this is supposed to be a date, you know? Worst date ever. And now that we're finally here, you don't want to go anywhere and you just want to hang around the entrance. What's the point in that? Oh my god. All right, fine. I was just about to walk in with you. Look, I'm sorry. I'm just a little bit scared, that's all. That's why I've been stalling. I was 
wrong, okay? Now that someone else is here, let's take a moment to calm down. They seem to be here to participate just like everyone else. I think we're intruding on them. I wasn't thinking clearly. This is a really odd location. Well, impulse. you know what? I'm sorry. Please. This reminds me of like a haunted house. So maybe that's. I mean, some people go on haunted house <laughs> things as a date. I know I shouldn't have yelled at you. Oh, they're making oh, up. It doesn't matter anymore. You're still the best, babe. Uh, who said you could call me babe? This sounds. This You're sounds so like a typical straight couple. Uh. You know. So they really are on a date? Do they know that when but you're with somebody that you're this? supposed to like them? Perhaps we should just leave them alone. <laughs> this is all your fault. Oh my! This place nearly scared me to death. Everyone's fighting. All right, all right don't lose your temper. We're leaving. Now, oh, you know okay? what? Maybe it's the maybe it's hmm. the drink. To think I used to believe you were brave. Wow. Uh, but this is different. Excuse me, but I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. Did you perchance encounter an evil spirit? If so, I'm here to track it. Could you please tell me which direction it went? Uh, who are you? No, I didn't see anything, so don't ask. <laughs> so please just leave me alone. I don't know what you're talking about, and I certainly don't want anything to do with an evil spirit. My apologies. Perhaps you misunderstood what I meant. I only wish to know what the spirit looks like and which way it went so we could track it down. If you can't describe its appearance, then at least show us the way it went. <laughs> he should bring me here. No, no thank you. I'm not going anywhere. No, no, we're not taking you anywhere. Oh my god. I am just asking you to show us. Ugh, no, forget it. All right, that's enough. Listen, if you keep talking like that, she might actually end up believing in that nonsense. Can't you see she's terrified enough already? You could go find whatever strange things you're looking for on your own. <sighs> My apologies. I didn't mean to frighten her. He's quite the serious exorcist. Yes. I'm just trying to hunt the evil spirit you mentioned to prevent it from hurting anyone. Isn't it a bit strange for an exorcist to come to the test of courage looking for evil spirits? Oh. I think I get it now. But we didn't say anything about a ghost or spirit. I think you misunderstood us. I brought my girlfriend here to have some fun, but instead she got frightened by all this spooky atmosphere. Now we'll just have to go home. I'm not too sure what you're looking for, but we did see some dark shadows making strange noises. Thank you very much. Yeah, maybe That's people shouldn't helpful. do dates here. Like, I don't know. This this does not well, seem like it. the greatest idea. Seems something unusual is going on here. But why would they ever want to come here if they get scared so easily? The point isn't getting scared. It's relying on each other in the face of fear. Oh. I have never had any fear of evil spirits, so perhaps I'm unable to understand their feelings. It's amazing that you're able to pick up on that. Good thing I brought you as my partner. Anyway, let's keep searching the area. We were trying to figure that out, Pigeon. Oh, sorry. Oh, boy. Sorry, I feel unwell. Who was it then that we, we decided? <sighs> oh, Zhang Ling. Zhang Ling and her father? Yang energy inside my body. Is it that serious? If there's too much Yang energy, I'm afraid that I won't be able to control myself. Even though you were willing to accompany me this far, uh, I don't want to cause you any further trouble. But we finally found some traces of an evil spirit. If I lose control, oh, couples! I fear that I'll be the one endangering everyone here, not evil spirits. We better find somewhere to rest. Uh, sure. Let's just have a rest. I'll continue this minute. Let me help you find a place. To I'm. I'm gonna go by myself. All right. You are an experienced adventurer, after all. I won't be far, so just call for help if you run into any danger. I don't uh, think there is. I'm beat. Finally, I can take a break. Hmm. Uh, I wonder if I took things a little too far. You people seem scared out of their minds. Who are you? Huh? Hey, you shouldn't be here. Uh, never mind. I assume you overheard me anyway. I work here pretending to be a ghost, but now's my break time, so. Oh, pretending to be. Off my costume. Oh my god. I get all hot and stuffy wearing that thing. So there are no real ghosts here? Of course. How could there be real ghosts here? No one wants to see a real ghost. No uh. We <laughs> just come here for the atmosphere, or should I say, the chance. Everyone wants the chance to feel the thrill of excitement. 
people find themselves in a scary situation, they'll say things that they'd never dare to otherwise. That's what the test of courage is all about. Interesting. <sighs> okay. I should get back to work now. Hope you and whoever you're here with have a fun time. Oh, you're back. So how did it go? I only did saw you see an evil spirit? I only saw an event staff member pretending to be a ghost. Huh? So that's what's going on here? He sounds like he's constipated. No, <laughs> no danger? It's all just a setup? Uh I'm sorry, but that seems to be the truth. I, I see. Oh my god. It seems I've been tricked again. Oh. I'm starting to feel more and more uncomfortable. Now that everything's settled here, let's head back to Liyue Harbor. Oh my god. But could you oh. help me walk back? You don't look so good. It's fine. I'll be okay. Uh, no, really. I'm fine. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my gosh, this one's really cute. I love this. All right, we're gonna do this one, I guess. I'm starting to feel something after that drink. Oh, here we go again. <laughs> no, no, I'll be fine. Let's go investigate the area. We are holding him and stuff. So this is the test of we could all I'm not too sure where we should these innocent participants are complete what? Uh Please, enlighten me. You're taking this event too seriously? I see. <sighs> Maybe I mostly spend my time besides training, I also need to so I rarely have any time for leisure activity. I see. Mm. Well either way. Hmm. The traces are quite weak either way. These possibilities prove my no, I don't think so. Although, once it became the murky anyway, these Oh, you don't think there's time for Noel? Yeah. No, I will um oh, sorry. If I don't finish sorry, Noel today, I feel... then I will do Noel, oh, Noel tomorrow because we have this entire week upcoming. Um and then uh, like the week well Monday, so we have this week upcoming and then Monday to just do random stuff. Um, and I will do Noel's for sure before 1.5. So, uh, I think the drink is it that serious? Too much yang energy. But we finally found some traces uh, of evil spirit. Control. Okay, so I haven't done this one. Uh, 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 I know it's next week. Feeling. It's becoming more intense. Uh, usually, I can manage by simply eating a popsicle. <clears throat> but that's only under normal circumstances. I may need something uh, a bit more potent in this case. Like cryo slime condensate or cryo whopper flour. I think I have some. these during your adventures, right? They're not fresh enough. Perhaps they're fine as typical ingredients. But they won't be potent enough to suppress the abundance of yang energy inside... Uh, shoot, um, I'll get cryo slime condensate. Thank you. I should be able to manage for the time being if I just focus on keeping calm. He sounds like he's constipated. We did it. It's dangerous to walk alone here, isn't It's dangerous it? to go alone. You have no idea who or what you'll meet. Hello. Hmm, you seem to be pretty calm. You know, there's a saying, you can't keep your shoes dry if you're walking along the river. You're bound to run into something in such a strange and eerie place. And what you encounter here could become a nightmare that haunts you for the rest of your life. Oh my god. <laughs> Lumine. Oh, really? Huh? How are you so calm? People <clears throat> usually run away in terror before I can finish a sentence. 
You look like just another average person yeah, to me. Yeah, but a more sophisticated way to play a ghost is to create a creepy atmosphere that scares people psychologically. In which case, my appearance becomes irrelevant. Besides, I'll never be able to scare someone like you who doesn't believe in ghosts to begin with. Sounds like you're just slacking off to me. <laughs> hey, that's not true. Oh, I better go find some wimps to scare now. You should go back and find your partner. He might be terrified by now. Thanks for finding these ingredients for me. Oh. I feel much better now. There we go. Although I still feel the yang energy stirring. At least I won't need to worry about it getting out of He's control. He's so cute. I can't. Uh, so, did you find any new leads when you were out looking for ingredients? Huh? Oh, so that's what's going on here? Oh, wait. Does that mean all the strange things here are just a hoax? See the truth? I... I, I see. So I was wrong again. Oh, sad uh, boy. I suppose there's no reason for us to linger here any longer. Um, remember that strange mist we found earlier? I'd like to investigate that. Okay, let's go. Yes, that was proof of an evil spirit's presence. But we can't be sure that the spirits still exist. Actually, I would also like to investigate that further. We've already come all this way. Let's have You're a look. Right. I'll focus my mind and spirit. Oh my goodness, he's Perhaps cute. it'd be more effective for us to split up. Evil spirits will keep their distance if they sense the power of my pure yang spirit. So you'll be more likely to find one if you're on your own. And then I'll wait for you to come and defeat it. I might defeat the spirit by the time you arrive. I'll wait for you. Yes, that would be best. Just keep it distracted till I arrive. I'll take this side. You take the other side. <laughs> Let's move. <laughs> Pincer attack. Oh. Huh? Um. Um. Can. 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 Can you help me? Help you? Um, that exorcist with the blue hair is so scary. Uh, can you get away from here? He makes me feel so frightened. Oh, are you being affected by his yang energy? I wouldn't dare get anywhere near him. Oh, his energy, it's so horrible. It'll make me disappear. Oh, I don't want to disappear. Please, help me. I wonder if he consider you an evil spirit. He'll have to be the one to... Oh, my God. Oh, well, I, I have an idea. I know, really. It's uh, just... I saw the kids the just apparently the don't do well in day vibes. I'll scare those troublemakers away, but you have to ask the exorcist to let me go, okay? Are you telling the truth? Uh, of course. Chen Chen never lies. She's so cute. So, um, what do you say? Okay, uh, but I'll try to explain the situation as best um, as I can. Uh, okay. So, I'll take that as a yes. I hope the exorcist with blue hair is a good person. Um, so, I'll help him and you'll go talk to him. Uh, hopefully then he'll leave me alone. Sound good? <laughs> hey, you've been turning the whole place upside down looking for evil spirits. Other participants are starting to complain. <laughs> yeah, why would an exorcist show up at the test of courage and tell everyone that there are no ghosts here? You're just stirring up trouble. We're getting in trouble. Honestly, I find this whole thing quite confusing. If there really are ghosts here, then you're using them to make Mora regardless of the participant's safety. You tell me, is that ethical business practice? And if there are no ghosts here, then your so-called test of courage is nothing but a big scam. Wow. Not only are you avoiding my questions, but now you accuse me of Isn't he getting trouble? spicy? I've already told you. This is what kind of event the test of courage is. It's not our problem that you're taking it so seriously. And now that you're disturbing our participants, we'll have to ask you to leave. Wow. If anything about this made any sense at all, I would leave of my own volition. But if I leave now... I'm leaving evil spirits to their own devices. I wonder what I should say in this situation. Oh, the ghost! There's a ghost! Run for your life! What, he angry. What's going on? Everyone's starting to panic. I is there really a ghost? <laughs> <sighs> Don't be silly. But if everyone starts running, someone could get hurt. Everyone, just calm down. 
No need to panic. Please move in an orderly fashion. The staff leaving her in, leaving you to I tell. See. Ah! So there's okay. no evil spirits here, just a wandering ghost. And she scared everyone away because I was in trouble? She only scared them. She didn't hurt anyone. If things are as you hey, say. Hey, Liquid Sense! And she doesn't seem like a malignant spirit. She's a ghost, but she's also just a kid. Uh, all right. As long as she promises not to harm anyone, then I'll Aww. pretend that I never knew about her. He's a big softie. However, if she ever does harm anyone, it'll be my job as an exorcist to come and purge her, to mend my mistake. I'll be equally responsible too. No, no, no. this is my call. I shall take full responsibility. Mm. We should go now. It doesn't seem we're particularly welcome here anyway. What's wrong? We got in trouble. I was under the impression that you wouldn't be willing to let a uh, Chin 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 go? I have faith in my judgment of good and evil. Oh. But if I begin to neglect my perception of good and evil, it may lead to something I'd regret for the rest of my days. I didn't expect you to have a gentle side. Wait, you mean you didn't think I could be fair and reasonable? Really? Do I look so obstinate? I know you better now. Yeah, you're right. All right, we should leave now. Let's say goodbye to Chin Chin. Uh, okay. I have to see this interaction. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, Chang Yoon really, like in this, in this picture right here, Chang Yoon really looks like I pretend I do not see it. Okay. Thanks for finding these ingredients. Although I still feel the yang energy stirring. At least... Uh, so, did you find any new leads when you were out looking for ingredients? Huh? Well, does that mean all the strange things here are just a hoax? Uh... Took it way too seriously? I... Uh, in that case... Oh, let's head back. Oh, sorry. This has all been a waste of your precious time. Maybe we could hang out together sometime. Mm. You're very kind. At least we checked the test of courage together and verified that the place is clear of danger. <sighs> but if only we had found some evil spirits, then it all would have been worthwhile. But we did! <laughs> Vegas, thank you so much for three months. I really appreciate that. How are you? Hang out hype indeed. Oh, this is a cute one. I like that. Just a small opportunity away from satisfactory outcome. Billy oh. Chill, Billy Chill. 